Happy, happy birthday to you, my friend. Have a good time. I won't be there, but I wish you the best. Happy birthday. Oh my goodness me, that's quite a moment. Thank you so much. It's no. so lovely to see you again, hey, darling. Hey, nice seeing you. Really lovely to see you again. So it was six years ago we last met. We were in Palm Beach. We're here in New York. It's all happening in New York. You want a coffee? You want a coffee? What? We can go for a coffee. We, off, can, get off, anything we, we can have anything. We can have anything we want. We can have anything we want in the in city that doesn't sleep. Even though technically, because I've just got in from London, it is the middle of the night. Fun fact about you, and I've got to bring it up because I just left Catherine Jenkins in the UK. She also sleeps with her eyes open, and you tell oh, me. Oh, you, you really have a had to bring this up. <laughs> yeah, but it's so freakish. <laughs> okay, you know the happy birthday. Yeah, are we scrubbing Cut it? it? Yeah, we're scrubbing Scram. it. We're scrubbing That's it. it. <laughs> no, we're out. <laughs> I think it's a real talent. The thing, the thing is that because I have dry eyes, mm. and 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 one day. My kids are looking at me and they didn't think that I was sleeping. And they said, Mom, and my, my sister, who's the godmother, and she said, Shh, Mom is sleeping, you know. But she said, Her eyes are open. It's freaky. We're scared. She said, No, 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 don't worry. So her eyes are dry a little bit and she, it, it stays white because the eyes are going like this. It's a little white. But she said, So the next day they said, Mom, this is freaky. You're scaring us. And I'm like, What? I said, don't be scared. Why are you being scared of your mother? You said, because when you sleep, you sleep with your eyes open. That's and I'm like, I sleep with my eyes open. And, and I said, because I have dry eyes. And, 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 and that's why sometimes they're a little white. But don't be scared of your mother. So uh, say I to her for me. I will do. I will do just that. Um, Celine Dion says, I. To Catherine Jenkins. Yes, please. Um, this is all about you, though. This is fantastic. It's six years since you released um, an English album. I'm very excited about this. And normally, with an interview like this, because you've been through so much since we last met, mm -hmm. um, you'd sort of build up to talking about that sort of personal side of things. But I, listening to Courage, which of course is the name of the album and the Correct. title track, mm -hmm. you lay yourself absolutely bare. I mean, you know, not just for fans, but everyone who knows that, you know, the, the love affair that you had, yeah. you know, that, that wonderful love. Unique. So unique. And it's all here in Courage. Yes. Was it, was it quite cathartic when you were writing that all? You know, when, when uh, it, took, it, it took a while to, uh, to record the album, it was a process. Um, losing a half of you um, because we were partners, um, we were one, um, even though he's not physically here, he is part of me. I see him every day through the eyes of my, my children. Um, when we started to uh, work on that project of a new album, this is actually my first English album um, without him uh, by my side. Um, so that was, that was emotional that was at the same time something that was telling me that you know um it's okay mm. i told him it's gonna be all right don't worry about anything just before he left i got this i always trusted you he trusted me we love each other so much you don't nobody deserves to suffer and you've done good kid so trust me and I got this. So when I started to record the album, I really wanted to prove to him. Um, I wanted to prove to myself. I wanted to prove to my children, because I'm a mother. That's the most important thing, and the thing that I'm the most proud of. And being a single parent, now it's like gives me even more of like something powerful in a way that I, they need me so much. Mm. So I need to teach them about independence, courageous. Um, and, and when you talk about courage, this is a big word. And by the way, I'm sorry about this sound. We are in New York. We're in New and York. It's part of the interview and there's nothing I can do about that. It's fine. You know, sorry. As I said, it's stopped. So 
Maybe I have something to do with I, I think you have some clout, Celine. Yeah, there's no doubt about that. We felt that's the why I sleep with my eyes open <laughs> because it's magical. But like you say, you, obviously you, you have to draw a lot of strength because you are a single mom and you are. And, and you have three to you boys. have to set the example. Mm. You know, you know, courage is. I feel like it's like um, um, like a foundation inside of you. You might you might not need it in your life. Um, you might, and everybody has it. Everybody has courage. Some people think they have a lot of courage. Some people think they don't have a lot of courage. Some people discover courage when they lose someone. Mm. Some people don't even know what to do. What, what, why would I? Sometimes something happens and you hold on to that. And I want my kids to be independent. I want them to feel courageous. Because courage is something that you can, that gives you so much strength, inner strength. And like I said, not that you want to use it a lot, mm -hmm. but if you need it, you have to, you, you got yourself. And I want my children to feel me that I got you and I wanted to show that. And courage, the courage song represent this whole album because um, a lot, the world goes through loss. I mean, now it's focusing on me. Oh, you lost your husband. Yes, mm. but how many people in the world, they they do they go through battles and they they lose th their spouse and their wives and their children and accidents and things. Drama happens so much. So it's, we've all we've all known grief like that. I think that's yeah. fair to say. And you only know that you have that courage when you are at the cliff face of something like that. Yeah, yeah. and you have to you have to either. Um, Find the strength and find your own courage to go through it. I mean, life imposes things on you, basically. Sure. And you have to... Step up. To, yeah, you have to step up. There's no choice. There, there's a line in, in the song about courage deserting you. You know, you, you don't want the courage to desert you. Did you ever find a time when and the courage wasn't there? That You know, those moments that you have when you steal yourself away, where you, you've got to dig even deeper to find that courage? Actually, the moment that it did happen, because at the house with my children, I was pretty much the, the leader of my, my camp, you mm. know. But in the business, as an artist, I never question anything that Renee has ever proposed to me to do. Um, if he said that, you know, we're going to do this show and I think we should do this tour uh, starting whatever he had planned I never questioned because I trusted him and loved him so much that he does his job I do my job mm -hmm. and my job is to try to sing the best I can and um, I, I, I thought he was extremely intelligent and brilliant and honest and 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 generous to to conduct a whole career at 51 years old I feel like I'm having another career starting mm. uh, so he must have done a few things right um, but there, there's been a moment um, that at one point everything started to like is is this an earthquake or something right because I not that I felt weak not that I felt that I was lost not that I felt that Oh my goodness, be able to do this, you know? No, because he's always been with me. He gave me so much luggage, so much knowledge. And I got my kids and I said, we, this, this, I'm gonna, we're gonna do this all together. We can do this. Um, but there, there's been a little bit of a moment, um, not too long after his passing, where I was looking at the people that I've been working with for so long and kind of not questioning anyone, not questioning myself, but like, okay, this is gonna be um, the same roller coaster, mm -hmm. but, and I can trust my team, but I'm gonna buckle myself up and it's gonna be okay. But there's been a moment where I, I kind of thought that um, it was, going to be a little bit shaky. Mm. And it's a good thing that um, the big majority of the people that have been working with Renee and I have been there for 
at least be between 20 and 30 years. And that has helped me tremendously to kind of sail mm. and manage this. You can draw a lot of strength from that. I mean, I think everyone can relate to that. Can I ask you about imperfections as you well? You can ask because me about anything. I love well, that. Within the realm, not since Jesus that you know that I see with my eyes open. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What else? <laughs> uh, the video for Imperfections is fabulous. You love to frock up, don't you? I mean, there is there is nothing that you cannot wear. But the song, aside from obviously the not fabulous even a small costume, range, just like that one. <laughs> <laughs> aside from the sure. fabulous frocks and the visuals of, of Imperfections, again, it's another track where you lay yourself bare as well, isn't it? Yeah. You know. Maybe it could have been a better idea at 22 to do that, but I don't think it we was have the that. Courage. I don't think we have the courage at 22 to do that. Do you think? It's not about the courage at 22. It's like you have nothing to lose, mm. nothing to win. You're still like a flower, just blooming. You don't even need water. But I really thought that I wanted to, for me, for me and for all the women who need to have self-esteem, some have a lot, some less, to say that, first of all, we, we all have imperfections. Nobody's perfect. And for me, the act of, whether it's like beauty light all the time, and the makeup, and the jewelry, and the clothing that I love so much, and and pretending, and like dramatic, and oh my goodness, oh, oh, oh. I love all that. And I really wanted to show as well, you know, we borrow um, characters. Mm -hmm. We're on stage. Mm -hmm. I love the spotlight. Mm -hmm. I love to show off. That's why I'm in show business. Mm -hmm. um, can't please everybody. I do the best that I can. I'm enjoying it. I'm having a good time. I really wanted to say to myself and thinking that maybe because I've been an open book all my life, mm -hmm. maybe if I do reveal behind that character that I've been playing or playing with the light and this is your best side, I'm, I'm telling you there's no best side, this is my best side, <laughs> okay, so this record straight right here. So um, I wanted to get, reveal myself in a way of like, this is me. With all the perfection of the imperfection, we all, we all mature, we all age, but there, there's things that mean so much. There, it means something. It means something. I don't want to be 22 anymore. I love to be 51. I'm enjoying my life. And I wanted that message to come across to the other women to say, you have to accept yourself. And don't get me wrong, I have nothing against people in the world who wants to go and fix a few things. Uh, because if it's to make them feel stronger and more beautiful and to feel like they want to conquer the world and all that, and they feel good about themselves, I would encourage that. But honestly, I wanted to reveal myself as an open book. This is it. What you saw two minutes ago, well, it was me, and, and now it's me. And you know what? It, it, it was all the more clear for me. I was very lucky to come and see you in Hyde Park in London this summer. It was what so fun. What a moment that was. It was so fun. It was the most beautiful night, summer's night, um, in the capital. And, oh. and you, the love you must have felt from the crowd that night. Listen, was the ocean. Right? The ocean. I was in bits. I, I was sobbing. Oh my God. The ocean of the people. And here we are on stage. I'm saying to myself, it's, day, it's daytime. So I said, I don't want to tear and go like, hello, everybody. <laughs> Hello, the nightlife. Hello, the boogie. On it is going on. Girl, I can't see nobody. No, I'm like, I'm taking sunglasses from technicians backstage. I'm like, <laughs> put this on, put this on. We're not crying. We're going to start the show. <laughs> no, no, no. 
with tearing, the makeup, everything. No, it no, no. It was beautiful. It was so good. And you're coming back. We must mention this. You're coming back next September to the But the welcome, I have to say. Thank you so much. I had such a, we all had such a great time. And we are going back. I can't tell us, wait. Tell us about the Courage Tour then, while well, I've still got you here in New York City for a few moments more. The Courage Tour. What can we expect? It's a legion of British fans. With my eyes open. Yes, the eyes will be open. And also, encouraging. with all my heart open. Um, we're going to do... Um, I think it's going to be next summer, if I'm not mistaken. Um, September. Thank you. In the thank UK. You, thank you so much. Oh, I'm, I'm um, booking my tickets, it's, it's okay, I'll fix it. You don't have to buy me your tickets. <laughs> That's Sorry. always good just to tell me, Just tell me how many you want. It's okay, all right. right. You can it's make that go away. You. That's my birthday gift to you. It is your name above the door. Uh, thank right. you, W. So, um, <laughs> um, well, this Courage Tour is like... Um, and the beginning of the, I don't want to say the beginning of the rest of my life, but it's the beginning of something kind of like, let, let me put it this way. Um, it's a fun show. It's, we have a, an amazing stage. My team is just amazing. The musicians, my backup singers, the whole team, the whole show, the stage, the video screens, the it's it's just I mean it's, I'm so proud so so proud of it excited it's so fun the classic songs uh, will be there can't sing all of them because I have three thousand four hundred and sixty five songs so I have to pick some of the new songs will join the show of course but um, it's just amazing because I really thought a while ago that we're going to have a career and eventually it's going to go kind of like it's going to fade you know it's natural it's going to fade and i'll do something else and unplug shows and smaller theaters and things i don't know but then i look at the people and my fans who were there 30 years ago they're coming and i'm like hi Okay, because you loved me. Thank you. <laughs> and like, okay, Beauty and the Beast, I love you too. Titanic? Oh, nice seeing you. Fantastic. But then it's like, they're still there. And then I turn around and I see teenagers. And then I look down, there's kids. What are you going to do with me? Am I studying all over again? Am I, I, being, am I, am I being cloned? You're the, yeah, you're the gift that keeps on giving. And very quickly, before I let you go, you're launching you're the album in go. New York. I don't want to let you go because I'm having too much fun, um, as I did last time we met. Um, karaoke, can we talk about that very quickly? You're, you're launching the album with a karaoke contest tonight in New York, and I just love that. I mean, I've seen your share impression, which is seamless. So if the work does dry you up. You love the law. You can, I can you feel can. something inside me say. I really don't think it's strong enough. She could be in the room. Could be in the room. And I've met her. Very lucky enough to meet her. She could be in the room. Karaoke. Fascinating. Who takes on Celine Dion in a karaoke contest? You should. Alan's in the stream. That is what we are. No one in between. How can we be, be wrong? I'll be wrong. Stay away with me. It could be belong and wrong, but it's not. There's another oh, 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 oh. from another, another to another. Oh, oh, oh. Celine Dion, everyone, you are an absolute Cheers. diamond. And happy Cheers. birthday, darling. Thank you. God bless you. You bless you too. God Have fun. You. Oh. Enjoy the Enchanted. big fight.